I got four words for you. Nestor Cortez is back. He's fishing today for the first time. Okay? Got today's lineup for you against the Toronto Blue Jays. Let's put it up. Okay? Anthony Volpe leading off playing shortstop. Aaron Judge batting second in right field. Anthony Rizzo's batting third in <clears throat> first base. Giancarlo Stanton DHing batting fourth. Josh Donaldson's batting fifth at third base. Willie Calhoun batting sixth in left field. Isaiah Kanafaleva batting seventh at second base. Rafael Ortega, center field, batting eighth. And at the dish, Carlos Navarez. Okay. Trevino needs a couple more days, but he's well on his way back to recovering and being ready for opening day. And we'll see what our man Nestor Cortez does today in his first in his first his debut this spring after having a grade two strain of his hamstring. So um I expect probably no more than two innings, but if he comes out of it healthy, you know, it's a good and encouraging sign, particularly since we've had some rough going already with Carlos Rodon and, you know, our, our potential fifth starter, obviously Frankie Montez being out and missing most of the year, but a couple of the other guys being knocked around. I mean, Herman and, and Luis Severino being knocked around. Clark Schmidt's looking better every start, so I'm happy there. But, uh, you know, <clears throat> once we get this rotation patched together and all healthy and rocking on all cylinders, I think uh, – we're going to be happy with this rotation. So, um, for right now, I think Clark Schmidt has the lead for the fifth spot. I'm not banking. On, I'm not uh, ruling out Matt Crook yet. He's still here. Pitched pretty well yesterday, and I said I think he could be out pitch or beat out Domingo Herman, maybe even Schmidt, but more likely Domingo Herman at this point. So, I mean, it could honestly be. It could be Cole. It could be Severino. It could be Nestor. Um, then it could be Schmidt, and it could be Crook until Rodon comes back. So, um. That's what it looks like right now. The Yankees are playing the Blue Jays again, getting another taste of their AL East rivals before the season starts. We are, how many days? 12 days from opening day. 12 days from opening day. I'm just pumped that Nesta Cortez is going to be in the mound today. The mustache is here. We got to see some pitching today. It's going to be good. So I wanted to get you to line up. We will live stream tonight. We'll also recap the game tonight. And uh, so I hope to see you all. You know, our Saturday night live streams are pretty lit, so they're going to be a lot of fun and uh, be in full effect. We'll talk about that. We'll talk about some of the stuff in the World Baseball Classic. There's so many different things, so many different pet pieces of chat are going around around the World Baseball Classic. Certain people, apparently certain people, and I mentioned this yesterday, apparently certain people want, want to cancel for a couple injuries. And then other people getting fired up about it. But I don't even know if the people getting fired up about it are the ones making that up. Because nobody's telling me if they're hearing as well from Major League Baseball people saying they want they, they want to cancel. So are people just making up stuff to rile people up? You know, that's who knows. I mean, people do that all the time anyway. So, um, but uh, we'll talk about that tonight too. We can laugh about it as well. But I want to know what you think, regardless. I'm not only about the World Baseball Classic, but being 12 days away and Nestor being back on the mound, hoping for. Good game today. I'm hoping for some offensive output. We still need – there's still positions that need to be filled, obviously, and decided on. So the competition is going to go right down to the very end, like I told you. I still think there's going to be a move or two happening in Yankee land. Probably roster people now. And, again, I'll say this again. If you want Volpe to make the roster, you want it to play regularly, you have to move IKF and Glaber Torres. You have to move both if you want to have Volpe up here and not sitting down and playing regularly. Give me your thoughts on that one too, gang. But uh, happy Saturday. Enjoy a beautiful day, all right, in uh, Yankee land, which is everywhere. And uh, go Yankees. See you all tonight.